What is up, Matthew Moore here for the first reaction to Sect by Golden Features. Have listened to his music in the past. All I'm gonna say is each subsequent project has just been getting better and better. So I'm curious what to see what he does on his debut album, Sect. The album is 44 minutes long, 10 songs in total. So let's get right into it with the first song, Always. All right, low tempo. I think the only comparable like tech house producer would be like Zoo. A nice down tempo track to start the album. I do like the vocoder that he put in to give it a hook. I was kind of worried that there were going to be no vocals at all in this, but however, I have heard better bass lines from some of his previous work, and that's something I really like about him is he has these really gummy bass lines. Next up is Medicaid. Oh, I know what this album is. Okay. Yeah, very pretty interesting. Oh, a little industrial, perhaps. Again, another solid down tempo track. That song a little bit more less like funk a little bit more dark and industrial two solid songs but none of them i think are my favorite so hopefully turn up a little bit more let's see if we can elevate things a little bit more this song is called runner some outrun electro <laughs> consistent with all these projects this album just seems a little bit more diverse so far each of these songs just seem like a little bit different but similar in some ways as well another solid cub track still sort of waiting on a sort of wow moment of the album especially with newer artists i just think there's something you gotta have to really stand out not really finding too much here, just some really solid music, which is not a bad thing at all, but let's just continue with Falling Out. Falling out. Okay. It's like very modern filter house. Super inventive drop. A pretty cool song like it was almost sort of like an anthem it was just like that catchy but kept that underground bassy vibe that's definitely the first song that i'm really in love with from this album definitely gonna be adding that to a couple playlists next up is woodcut <laughs> hearing that song it does seem like this album is going to sort of like a dark to light trajectory the song and also the song before falling out just seem a little bit more peppier a little bit more happier than the last songs but this song in particular is definitely the most gentle and calm song of the album so far so i definitely enjoy the fact that the album has a flow to it unlike a lot of other albums this year that have been sort of just more like compilations so let's see if the album continues in this direction with pyre Huge shift in emotion and energy. This might just go into the new song. This kind of feels like a uh, some sort of interlude track. Really cool, actually. Hella dark. Do a couple of songs called Pyre. It just seems like you're just watching like an old ass church just burn to the ground, and, like the end of a horror movie. Really cool interlude track. I didn't expect it at all. Next up is Renewal. Oh. 
that's the first like i think true golden features based on the album where it's like sort of that x factor baseline where definitely just a huge sleeper banger next up is worship hey this breakdown is killing it. That's really solid. I want to listen to that song again, to be honest. That song was actually really cool. Another favorite, Renewal and Worship. Favorites in a back to back. Second to last song is Everything. Oh, this is somatic shit right here. Well, that song was actually really pretty and, you know, just another solid track. I think it was a little too long. I didn't need that whole outro sort of thing. It just seemed... The last song of the album is 1991. Right now. All right, little intro. Where we at? Where we at? Look how pretty, but also at the same time dissonant it is. Like, really, so many cool elements in it at once. I really did not expect like a breakbeat sort of jungly song to really wrap that whole thing up. I didn't think I needed that song to be six minutes long. That's something I'm probably gonna be going back to. Album as a whole is, you know, fairly solid. I wouldn't necessarily take out any of these songs. Maybe short of the length of some of these songs, but this is not necessarily an album that I would recommend to people that aren't into bassy tech house and sort of the zoo or the Maddox wave, or in this case, the Golden Features wave. Just sort of that sound, that dark, clubby underground area. If you're into that dark, underground, clubby sounding music, this album's definitely for you. It's probably gonna be one of your favorites of this year. Standouts for me personally on this album is Fallout, Renewal, and Worship. Plenty of other solid tracks on this album as well. So let me know, guys, what you thought of this album below. If you enjoyed the video, remember to like and subscribe. This has been a first reaction to Sect by Golden Features. I'll see you guys next time.